Here's this Aaron from 4 and uh, oh. Sorry, it is cold out there. Sorry, that when we drug you in. I know fall is <laughs> upon us. What Definitely. Are we, what do we got going on today, Aaron? Today, while it is getting colder, it is. people are going out riding. Right. So I figured, why not give them products that can help them stay out there a lot longer? Oh, cool. You mean like when they're out in the desert, dry camping, they can stay out for longer with their batteries not dying? Exactly, Nathaniel. Cool. I say we fall right into it then, huh? That works for me. Hey, Aaron. Well, I can see we got a couple of products here. Why are these products today? Nathaniel, these are two products I can't recommend enough when it comes to extending my trip outside. Um, that's why I brought them here today because the viewers need to know about them, especially to go out to the dunes and all that stuff. These products are must-haves. So I can see we got a uh, Onion 2500 portable inverter generator. Mm -hmm. Go ahead, tell me a little bit about this. Why do you like this generator? Well, one of the first things I love, as you can see, it is lightweight, not too bulky. You can kind of pick up, move it wherever it needs to be yeah. um, with ease too, which is what we want with camping. We want it easy. Uh, this right do. here is definitely easy when it comes to picking up, moving around. Also, another thing I love about it, it runs off a gallon of fuel, which will get you about eight hours with half the load. Oh, wow. So if I'm calculating this right, if I bring five gallons of fuel, that'll, this generator will run me for 40 hours? Yes, which I told you, I'm trying to extend your trip. So this is why I brought this right here. That sounds really neat. Now, um, I know uh, I've seen online and a lot of generators don't come with a digital readout, but I've heard this one has a digital readout. Is that this true? This one does indeed have a digital readout, which me, I need to see things visually. I'm a visual person. Yeah, yeah. This has a digital readout, which will tell you what you're pulling and how much gas is left in there. Um, also has a little USB right here. So we're sitting around a campfire. You can plug in two phones while you're charging. Yeah. I mean, you know, we all sit around the campfire and you always have your phone and it's typically dead at the end of the day. So it's kind of nice to be able to charge it, right? Oh yeah. One of the little perks that I love about it, you know? So, hey, Aaron, I got another question for you. So for our viewers, they have 30 amp RVs. Yeah. This generator isn't a 30 amp R uh, generator. So how do they run their ACs off this generator? Well, this is 18 amps, um, but there is solutions to it. So don't worry. Um, we can install a soft start, okay. which will help out tremendously. But in hotter temperatures, we will need another generator to pair with this one and a dual adapter. Then we can get our 30 amps that way. And from that point, you'll Just be good, be to, good, go. good, to, go. good oh, to go. Oh, that sounds cool. So that, that'll be nice and cool in the summer. Yes. That sounds cool. Also, Aaron, so I see you got the 4500 here. What yeah. do you like about this generator? Well, the 4500 does everything the 2500 does, but of course, more, as you can tell by the size. It is bigger, a little bit bulkier, but there is a handle, there is wheels. So it is still very portable, very easy to move still. Yes. Also, one thing I like about it too is remote start. Who doesn't I mean, like a remote start? How cool is that? Well, I mean, I know if I'm in the, if it's in the fall, like we are, it's cold outside. I don't want to go outside to kind of pull this or hit a button to start it. Yeah. If I can do it from the comfort of inside, turn it on, I'm game for that. Yeah, let it warm up while you drink your coffee on the porch, you're good to go. Also, it has a 30 amp plug-in, so you don't even need an adapter. Most generators don't have that, so that's a big feature. Two 15 amp plugs right here, echo mode, it has the gauge. It's the whole shebang in this one right here. Yeah, sounds like it's everything you would need. And no issues with running the AC. You know, so you don't need a DAT or you don't need a soft start. Yeah. This one right here will get the job done. So what if I have a uh, 50 amp plug? How do I run both of my ACs? Because this doesn't have 50, only has 30. What do I do? Well, you got me again. But there is a solution to that as well. We can also get another dual adapter, just like we did here, another generator, and plug it in. And then we have 50 amps right there. So where there's a will, there is a yeah. way. Sounds like you got the solution for everything. Well, I try. Hey, Aaron, that sounds really neat. But... I got a surprise for our a viewers. Surprise. Yeah. yeah. Okay. I brought something fun too. You brought something. Yeah. Can you carry this down and show them how lightweight it is? Yeah, it is portable. Ah! No, I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So what we got is just got these Lifeline Lithium 100 amp hour batteries. Look at those things. Don't they wow. look beautiful? They are. Look how shiny beautiful. they are. Look at it. You even have like the fall in them. Nathaniel, so I told you what I love about my generators, but what's so special about these batteries? Why are you so excited? Well, Aaron, there is tons to be excited about on these batteries. First off, just like all lithium batteries, they are lightweight, so very lightweight. They're small, they're basically the same size as a Group 24 uh, 12 volt battery. These batteries will recharge in anywhere from one to two hours. They have a five year warranty, free replacement. Lifeline is a great company to work with. We've worked with them for many years. They're based out of here in Southern California, um, and they're just starting to really push themselves in the RV world. So um, just a great, great company. Um, next, the batteries have a Bluetooth option where you can 
get on your phone and you can see what the battery is doing. Is it charging? Is it discharging? Oh, wow. What's the voltage? What's the amperage? Um, and just see much more information. It'll, it'll show you what each cell is doing. Um, these batteries also have cylindrical cells. They're not the flat plate cells, right? Because those flat plate cells can be dangerous if those get punctured. We, we don't want to tell you yeah, what Yeah, heard about yeah, that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, also, the batteries uh, paralleled with solar are amazing. They can help you stay out there longer. And it's just, I mean, what, and that's what's the better than that, video, right? Yes. Something with these generators that'll recharge these batteries within an hour or two. Yes. Solar to keep it maintained as you're out having fun off-roading or wherever you're at. I mean, what can be that, right? Nothing. I mean, you go out there to have fun and hassle-free, right? Uh, hassle-free so, is what we try to do for our viewers. I think with this kit we just presented to our viewers, you guys will go out there, you'll have plenty of fun, no worry, and you'll stay for as long as you like. Definitely, definitely. Yeah. Did you have anything else you want to say, or is it time to check out? That's basically it. This is Aaron from 4 Army Fun, checking out. This is Nathaniel with 4RBFun.com, checking out. Always remember to like, share, and subscribe this video. If you have any comments, just comment below. Also, if there's anything you want to see us do, let us know, and we'll try to make a video on that. So always remember to relax, take it easy, and, and let us take, take the, the hassle of RVing for you. you. Be blessed.